A one Vietnam veteran is creating something very small to pay tribute to military heroes, and he's doing it in a very big way. Ryan Risky shows us these miniatures and how they're being hand painted. Oliver Williams took on a new hobby 57 years ago when he started collecting lead military figures and then painting them. When he was in his teens looking for something to do, he found a magazine article that piqued his interest. I saw an article, I think it was in the Parade magazine that used to come out with the paper on the figures and just got interested in them and started collecting and painting them. Painting the figures requires focus and research. William says painting them helps keep his mind off of other things. It's a good diversion when I get distracted by all the things that are going on that are annoying in life. <laughs> his longtime interest is reflected in the figures. I've always been interested in military history, so I'm interested in the uniforms, and a lot of them are personalities of military people. William says it takes a lot of work and fine-tuning to finish the figures off once he acquires them. They come in bare metal like this, and they have to be primered with the paint. They're lead figures, and most of them are made through the 60s and 70s. They're not so prevalent now. And after that, uh, you just start painting. Each figure takes weeks to complete. There's a lot of detail that you have to put into them. And research, you have to research the uniforms. In Davenport, Ryan Risky. And KCAU 9 News is proud to tell the stories of our veterans, especially those here in Siouxland. And make sure to join us tonight at 10 for this week's edition of